steel wires sandwiched between four layers of yellow barricades, a little way off, buses and trucks parked crisscross fashion, the Delhi police have left little to no chance in their efforts to stop farmers from entering or leaving Delhi. Delhi police were also seen carrying steel rods which looks like an attempt to intimidate and indirectly threaten the farmers. Sharp iron spikes have been placed on the road leading to the main protest site at Tikri and Singhu borders. On Monday, police officials were seen supervising the installation of concrete barricades with a cement mixer pouring concrete between two layers of barricading near the main stage area. The two layers were also joined with iron rods in between them to strengthen the barricading further. Besides heavy metal and concrete barriers, the police have created a wall at Singhu and Ghazipur by pouring concrete between two rows of cement barricades. Several routes leading to the protest site were either barricaded, closed using wires or dug up, restricting movement of farmers between the protest sites. All these measures have been deployed to deprive the farmers from basic human necessities like food, water, medicine and other essentials. Hundreds and thousands of farmers and their families, including children, are there. Water supply and electricity is disconnected. It is an inhuman activity. You please right. ask them to resume that yeah. electricity and water supply there. Right.